U.S. must not interfere. Biden's advisor on possible dismissal of Ukraine's commander-in-chief, Jake Sullivan, national security advisor to the U.S. president, has stated that the U.S. must not interfere in the possible dismissal of Valery Zaluzny, commander-in-chief of the armed forces of Ukraine. Sullivan said this in an interview with CBS. This is not something the U.S. government should be weighing in on one way or the other until we have stayed out of that set of personnel decisions, he said. He added that it's the sovereign right of Ukraine and the right of the president of Ukraine to make his personnel decisions. We've been clear, we're just not going to get embroiled in that particular decision. We have indicated that directly to the Ukrainians, Sullivan noted. Earlier, the Washington Post, with references to two sources familiar with the decision, reported that the Ukrainian government had informed the White House about the decision of Volodymyr Zelensky to dismiss Valery Zaluzny, commander-in-chief of the armed forces of Ukraine. Amid limited gains made in the two-year war against Russia, Volodymyr Zelensky is mulling a reset to replace several top officials, including the commander-in-chief of the country's armed forces. For weeks, the speculations have been rife that Zelensky will fire the highly popular Valery Zaluzny. The two have been at odds over the current strategy to make headways in the war. It is a question of the people who are to lead Ukraine. A reset is necessary. I am talking about a replacement of a number of state leaders, not only in the army sector. Zelensky said, when I speak of turnover, I have in mind something serious that does not concern a single person, but the direction of the country's leadership. He added when asked about Zaluzny.